Good morning, everyone. How you doing on this beautiful Thursday morning? I don't know if it's beautiful by where you're at, but uh, it definitely is, as you can see behind me. has some clouds, but, you know, it's still my season. We got another month and a half, something like that. So, yeah, it's been, it's, 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 it's a beautiful morning. So, but yeah, uh, one thing I forgot to mention yesterday is I did continue to uh, do my exercises uh, day two. <laughs> but um, yeah, it was good. It took it a little easy because uh, my neck injury was uh, flaring up on me uh, pretty bad. So I took it a little easy, but I still did it. Still was out walking. It's like, hey. Yeah, and it was definitely flaring up on me last night, and I took the night off from ride-sharing work uh, because of it, and it was good. It was a good thing that I did. So, yeah, I have to adjust my hat there. The sun's in my eyes. I'm not used to walking this early in the morning. It's like, whoa. <laughs> yeah, I woke up a little bit early this morning, so... But anyhow, I definitely am feeling a lot better, a lot more energized, and... Uh, yeah, looking forward to doing a little bit of cooking this morning and so on and so forth. So, yeah, it's going to be a great day. I know it is. So, I know you all only have a couple more days uh, worth of work today, tomorrow. Hope it goes well for you. I hope you're doing well, as always. So, anywho, uh, so, yeah, um, trying to think what it was I was going to... Uh, talk about you know as far as uh, oh um, going with the flow you know um, I know it can be difficult at, at times with uh, especially with our chaotic lives and so forth but you know that's the that's part of life you know going with the ebb and flow with things trying not trying not to be uh, too controlling and so forth and uh yeah i know i just feel like uh, a little bit lost to tell you the truth i have had something on my mind all week uh something that i have been uh uh i don't want to say i've been going through or whatever but it, kind of a decision that i've had to make and uh yeah it's definitely been a bit um i don't want to say challenging but but it has tested um some things with me. It's made me think about a lot of things. And one of those things that I've had to be thinking about also is recently, uh, I think it was about three weeks ago, something like that, I had uh, dove real deep into my birth chart and discovered quite a few things. <laughs> I mean, I looked at everything. I looked at uh, each of the signs, the houses, the different aspects, so on and so forth. And uh, yeah, there, there was quite a bit that came out. Uh, things that I, that have happened in my life. Um, I, re I realized that basically it was written in the stars and planets. Uh, <laughs> so on and so forth. Yeah, and different aspects about myself. I, I learned a lot about myself. Um, so, but yeah, I, um, a lot of that has come out here recently as well. And it's, it's made me do a lot of thinking about myself. So, I'd be curious to know if any of you have ever done that. I know you can do the reports and so forth. But, you know, at the same point when you're doing those, <clears throat> looking at the, those uh, reports, that somebody else is doing for you, it, uh, you know, it's, it's somebody else's take on it. And really when you're going down the spiritual journey, uh, you have to look, um, look at what resonates with you, what triggers you. Um, and I'd be curious to know if anybody out there has ever done that, done it on your own. And uh, what you found out, was there anything that was shocking and surprising? <laughs> or maybe it was like, you know what, this is all spot on. 
nothing surprising here. So yeah, I'd be curious to know if any of you have ever done that. Uh, Cause I know for me, it's been a very interesting experience. So anyway, I love you all. I'll talk to you soon. Take care. Mwah.